Hey everybody, welcome back to Train Enable, where we help you become fit, happy, and confident through custom tailored workouts. Today is Wednesday, and like so many Wednesdays past, we're gonna get into a home workout. This is going to be an intense leg workout, like we already said, you can do at home. So, we're gonna let you choose how many sets you wanna to do today, but we are advising three to five sets. And in each set, you're gonna do six Bulgarian split squats, and that's each side. Then we're going to do eight jumping lunges, and that's total 10 jumping squats. We're gonna finish off that round with either a 30 second squat hold or a 30 second wall sit. So first you're gonna to need to pull out a surface for you to elevate that back leg for the Bulgarian split squat. So chair, bed, couch, couch is what I'm gonna use. So we're gonna try and get that front foot out from us a little bit. Back leg goes on that surface like we talked about. And I'm gonna try and keep that knee over my heel the whole time. As I lower myself down, kind of close to that um, surface where I'm elevating, and I'm going to stand through that front heel, trying to keep my balance. I normally start on the non-dominant side, so that way I can just kind of get it out of the way. That's our Bulgarian split squat. The next move we're gonna get into is the jumping lunge. That's exactly what it sounds like. We're gonna come down to that lunge, right? So knees over the heel in the front, much like that split squat. Hip is over the knee in the back. Going to jump, switch my leg position, and lower myself down nice and quiet so I don't smash my kneecap. So jump, switch, come back down. And that one we're doing eight total, not eight each leg. Next movement is the jumping squat. So if you're gonna be in my squat stance, it's about underneath my shoulders. I'm gonna push the hips back, then I'll descend as low as I can. I'm going to jump, little bit of daylight under the shoes. It's probably worth noting, the higher I jump on all of these movements, obviously the harder it's going to be. Last movement for the round is gonna be a doozy because we're gonna do either a 30 second squat hold or a 30 second wall sit hold. Squat hold is exactly what it sounds like. I'm going to lower down into that squat position, trying to stay active. So my arms are not resting on my legs, driving those knees out, driving my chest up and then I'll stand once my 30 seconds is up, of course. If you have space on your wall, closer you are to 90 degrees on the knee, the harder it's going to be. So the rest in between these rounds are gonna to be totally up to you. So when you stop feeling burning in the legs or you're no longer winded, it's probably a good time to go again. So I hope you have fun, work hard, get sweaty. Share this with a friend who you think needs a nice at-home leg workout. If you found value in this, make sure that you like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you guys here next Wednesday for another workout. Beautiful.